Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Randy Brown versus Elizu Zaleski. Randy Brown, 18-5, and 4-1 four and one, his last five fights. His last loss came against Jack Della Maddalena, who just TKO'd uh, Gilbert Burns in the third round. And kind of a comeback victory, to be honest. Minus 155 favorite, 33 years old, 6'3", 78-inch reach, reach, 5-inch reach advantage for Brown. He's a big, big welterweight. Uh, Zaleski, 24 wins, 7 losses, 1 draw. He's 3-1-1 one, and one in his last 5 fights. And that 1 loss is against Muslim Sadikov, split decision. If you watch that fight back, Zaleski probably won that matchup. And then the 1 draw is against Renat Fakhradinov, where he got dropped very early in that matchup and came back and almost finished Renat. Kind of made a bit of an error where if he would have kept striking uh, uh, Fakhradinov on the ground when he hurt him, probably finishes him. He just stopped striking, started grappling with him a little bit more, kept him in there. Not great, but again, is 37 years old, so four years, four years, uh, eight, four year age difference, actually about three year age difference. I really like Zaleski in this one. I think even if Randy Brown is, is up on the scorecards because he's just moving, sticking and moving, I think Zaleski will at some point be able to close that distance, whether it's, it's, whether it's with his punches or his ability to um, uh, yeah, use his power, use his striking, use his combinations, his kicks, his really, really good defense, making Randy Brown overcommit. I like Zaleski a lot. He has good rear naked chokes, finished Curtis Millinder. He has 17 finishes i believe he has like oh man what is it uh 10 first round finishes has been finished once in the third round that was against the leech has been finished twice by submission but not in the ufc he has four finishes in the ufc his record is 10 3 and 1 in the ufc so you know in randy brown a two fight winning streak he's 12 and 5 in the ufc he's was that 12, 12 finishes? He only has four finishes in the first round. He's not typically a guy that, that gets finishes early, even though, yes, he finished Salikov in the first round, just oh, under 320 in the first. The tournament fight, arguably, he lost. Jack Della was able to catch him with a big punch and submit him, and arguably, Zaleski has better grappling than Jack Della Maddalena. Beat Chaos Williams by split, you know. A little bit younger, but Zaleski is such a dog, man. Such a dog. Like I said, fought Fakhradinov, beat Abu, fought Benoit St. Denis, even though it was a different weight class for St. Denis. Lost to Salikov, but some people thought he won. Fought the Leech, like I said, lost against him. Beat Curtis Millinder. Sean Strickland, he KO'd. Beat Max Griffin, Lyman, Lyman Good, Amari, and Nicholas Dalby lost by split. Um, there's a lot, a lot to like there. I like Zaleski. I think he gets the job done and probably by finish. And as always, subscribe, like, comment. Peace.